Hi everyone, it's Jackie here. So we're going to work some more on this journal, which I've decided to call the Dewey Journal. Dewey's Journal, because that was the name of the cookie on the box. All right, so I've just taped this on here um, with some washi tape, just so I don't move it around, because I want it to be close for you guys to see. So I've got some stuff. I've decided to go with this photograph, which I have totally, um, you know, wrecked, distressed, um, torn up to make it look like it's been, you know, traveling around maybe in her, her boyfriend's or husband's, um, wallet or back pocket or somewhere like that, um, or whatever men carried at this age. I don't know. I'm not historically correct on that. I've got a bits of some, um, vintage laces. Uh, I've got some ribbon. This is not vintage, but I made a little uh, ribbon, a uh, little uh, ruffle with some ribbon. I've got some tea bag, and I've got this little clip I thought might go somewhere, this little paper clip flower, and I also have a bulb pin that we might put something on there. So I sort of have an idea of what I want to do. This I think I want to put down here. Um, let me see. She's going to go somewhere in here. I'm not sure. This I kind of want up in the corner, and I want it to go a little bit over the edge onto this is our spine, but I don't want to cover up too much of that. Um, so I'm going to pull it up so it hangs off the top a bit. And like that. If I put her there, where's that go? Okay, maybe down a little bit more. Down on the spine. Um, not quite so much over the spine. Like that. I'm telling you, I don't know what's going on. The minute I come in this craft room, my nose starts getting all snuffy, and I don't know what's going on. There must be something in here. Could it be paper dust? Um, hmm, could be, I guess. <laughs> All right, then I have a piece of this. Maybe I will put that over there, and then maybe I'll put this. I don't know. This is just some um, old piece of uh, wax paper that I used for something. Could be parchment, I'm not sure. There, I wanted some of that pink to show. Not entirely sure I like this up here. I did put some stuff there. I don't know if I want that there. Let's see what this is. What if I put this here? I'll let that come off the top a little bit. And put this here. Like that. And maybe this on the side here where that can just come over and hang over that way. I might put that on there. Maybe. I don't know. Excuse me one second. I'm going to sneeze. <laughs> Excuse me. I don't know what it is in this room. I have some other little pieces of um, things like that. I just want to put a lot of layering on here. Lots of layers. That's going to go on there with a button or a bead or something. What else do we need on here? Let's see. Possibly a little piece of, of uh, paper, maybe. A little piece of paper on there that could go on there. Let's just, I just want to rip that edge so it's not a total straight edge. That's kind of cool. Like that. I think she's got to come up a little bit. We're going to lose that flower, but I got to get her up more towards the middle there.
All right, I'm gonna try something else just because I want to try this down here. Do I wanna try that down there with that all hanging off like that? I kinda like that. This, um, I think I'm gonna cut this. Let me move you over a little bit. There we go. Yeah, I like it there. It was just a little too big for the space. That's gonna go there. This is gonna go here, like this. Okay, that's okay. I would rather cover up these leaves than the flower, but okay, that can go there. Yeah, I like this on the bottom right here. But you could also tuck this right here too. Okay, let's see. I think I'm gonna start with this and decide where we're gonna put that. That might go on the edge here. And then we'll see. I feel like that needs something. I feel like that's gonna go over the top of her. Okay, so let's just start a little bit here. Let's start a little bit. Let's start with a glue stick. And we'll put this on, now let's see. Pull that off her over here okay and then we're just gonna start with sticking some of this whoops together like that so like that like that and we want this to go on the side here hang off a little bit That's going to be allowed to hang off here. And then that's, that's going to go in there. This is going to go here. Let's just put her back on. Do I want that over the top of her as well as over the top here? No, I think that goes under her. Yeah. You know what I am going to do? Ah, I've already glued it on. I was thinking, let's put a little stitch. I'm just gonna put a little stitch down through there on my machine real quick. Just quick, quick, quick. All right, just so that stays together like that. just put this down here somewhere like that okay and then that's gonna go like that maybe even over a little more this this lace I like because you can really kind of pull it out a little bit okay let's see let's glue this on here this off and I'll just stick it up here. I'm just gonna stick that on. Let's put it over. Put a good lot of glue on there. And we're allowing that to stick off quite a bit. Okay, let's, let's glue down. I don't know, I think I want another little piece of tea bag, like here maybe. Yeah, I don't think I can really do anything much to this, but I'll try to put a little ink on it.
has turned it completely around. Okay, like that. That goes over there. All right, I'm gonna just tag this onto here by stitching. Just a little stitch. I don't know, I'm thinking it might look good, cool. Interesting, just a tiny bit. That's it. Just like that. See, just a little bit across there. Yep, I'm gonna leave that string. I'm gonna cut it a little bit down. Okay. Yep, I'm gonna put this on this side. There, underneath. I feel like I need, oh, what's my ribbon right here? I was going to say, I need more color. Well, here you go, right there, right? Do we want that? Do we want it along here? Oh, I almost like it there. I almost really like it right there. that a little bit. All right, uh, let me take a look at this here. Let's see. Uh, let's see, what else do I want? I don't like, this is just too shiny for me. Hang on. Let me grab my little sand block right here, and I'm just gonna. There we go. This just takes some of that shine off. Yep. There. There. Now she's. She's really worn up now. Yep. That's just sandpaper, and I actually have a lighter one that's not so coarse that would look better, but I'm just looking in my little bit of stuff to see if there's anything else I might want to add on this. Um, we're getting a lot of stuff on here, that's for sure, aren't we? Yep. Piece off there. This is just a, I don't know, old, it's a piece of some lace stuff I had and I've used it. This is probably very close to being the end of this. Oh, that might look pretty right there. Just lots and lots of layers right down underneath there. Oh, that's not sticky. I'm going to have to get out my other glue, I think, for that. too much but I'm gonna go over to here and then that's gonna go around the edge like that oh yeah that's not even sticking at all Let's see if I can make this stick here Still not got this stuck down. So maybe this just needs to go across the top like that. Yeah, maybe that's what this needs to do and around the back like that. Oh, come on, get off of me. There. How 
about that? How about that? Just like that. Sticking up over the top. I'm going to stretch this out a lot to get it to just do that. Okay. Not you. Just, oh, shoot, I just want this part to go over there. You know, time, it's a little time consuming when you're putting stuff like this together because, I don't know, probably not for everybody, but for me, it takes a while to get things where I want them. I think, yeah, that's going to go under there, though. I guess um, I might cut this a little bit. Let's just cut down like that and then kind of like that. Yeah, I like that. Okay. This has got to get some glue on it because it's just, it's a mess. Oops, and that was sewn. So now, and that's glued on. Okay, it's okay. Let's just got some glue. My glue is all ouch. Goodness, that was a little sharp on that. Yeah, let's do that. That goes under. This goes over. Okay. Yep. Like this. to get her glued on here. She's all over the place. This is going to go under like that. Yep. Mm, okay, let's see. I'm going to hold this on the side a little bit. all dry, no worries. Okay, very good. Now let's glue some more of this down. Again. looking whoops I untaped that and I did not want to go and it's crooked but it's still in frame here sort of yeah I'm gonna have to get out yeah it doesn't want to glue on here very well so I'm gonna have, might have to get out my other glue okay that can glue there this is going to glue across here and over here a little bit like this under here like this. Let's just, whoops, you can't see what I'm doing. So sorry. That's cute. That's pretty cute. I like that. Okay. We're, we're doing good. We're doing a good, good job right here. All right. Let's come along. Let's come along. Good. I like that there. Let's see if we can get this to go down here. Oops, get off of there. So I want this to be sticking over the top like this and around the side like that. So we're going to stick that there and then I'm going to just put some glue right here so that can stick down like that. I don't know if I even asked how y'all were doing today. I hope you're doing well. Um, lots of stuff.
stuff going on. It's yucky here. It's just raining, 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 raining. No snow. It's not cold enough to snow here. It's been a relatively warm winter so far, which I'm not really complaining. It's just a little scary when, you know, you're used to having quite a bit of snow and there's nothing. There's just nothing. So, yeah. All right. Oh, so far, I think everything is glued down now. And I'm pretty happy with that. That's going to get on there. In fact, I'm just going to pop that. Maybe I want it over here. Do I want it up here? I'm not sure. I'm going to pop it over here on the edge for now. And we'll put um, some beads or something in there on that. All right. So let's, this is all got to dry pretty well. What time is it? Oh, 20 minutes. That's good. So this has got to dry, so, and then I think there's still some work to do. I think we still need something up here. You know, it could be a flower or something. I'm not sure. I'm glad I added that. I like that. And actually, we could add another piece of that up here um, if we wanted to, just to go there, which maybe we will. I'm not sure. Could. We could. So we'll leave this out because we might use that. Okay. So let me just, I'm going to just move this so it can dry because there's a lot of glue and a lot of things we want to just dry. And I'm actually going to move you back up a wee bit because I'm going to show you the pages I've put together for this. All right. So I put together, um, let's see, I think six signatures. They're basically the same. I've allowed them to raggedy out a bit, so let me show you. So I took two pieces of my um, of these pages from Medieval Mirage, and I cut them all, ripped them out, and then I glued them back to back with another piece, as you can see in here, um, and then <coughs> stitched them together. All right, and I inked them all. And then, oops, let's get down here where it belongs so you can see, okay. Then I added a piece of coffee dyed paper, which I also used my tear ruler to rip. Well, this is actually out of a, a book, not even a vintage book, but I, the paper is really nice in this that I coffee dyed. Um, a sheet of um, notebook paper, a sheet of coffee dyed paper, and a sheet of ledger paper. So there's four pages in each of these little signatures. Okay, so they're pretty thick. Um, and I, I allowed them to be a little bit taller. And when I sew them in, I'm gonna have to make sure I get them, you know, a little bit even on each side and wider so that I can add some things to the edges. And that, I think is all I'm gonna add. I'm gonna double check it again when the cover gets dry. But once you start putting some pockets in here and things, it's gonna fill it up to that two inches um, pretty well because you know if I don't smush that together, that's that's a pretty good spine. I mean that's a pretty good thing right there. I've never done five signatures in a little notebook. But, um, yeah, we're going to see how it goes. All right, let me see. And I left all my strings on. You can see all these strings are everywhere. I, I like it that way. I like those. All right, let's see what we're going to do. Now, I have some fun little pockety things that I made. Not pockets. These are little um, scrappy tabs to put on the edge of, of pages. I'm sort of looking for the rest of those. Where are they? Um, right here. So I made these on old, I can't remember who did it. Somebody, it's probably um, Shabby Dabby Doo Dah is what I'm thinking. And you just take an old piece of, you know, this scrap of paper that's fairly scrapbook, you know, cardstock weight. And then you just start gluing and you just glue pieces on. And it's a whole lot of fun. Actually, I didn't do that side yet. It is a whole lot of fun. So let me see. 
No, that's not it. I, maybe I used, did I use all of those? I might have. Um, because it was quite a lot of them. And, um, I did use quite a bit of them. I thought they had more, but the moment, um, I'm not actually seeing any more. So we'll just use these right here. Um, and I'm just going to be adding some. So what you do with these, those are wider. I want some of these longer ones, I think. Is you just go in here and you just rip them out like this. Like this. Okay. And then um, rip it however you like. I'm going to come in a little bit. And I'm gonna come in with this. Um, I'm gonna use different colors, I think, on here. Whoops, not you. To just go around my edges. And I'm gonna try to get kind of close on my edges here. Now the back, you have to kind of decide. These, mine are gonna be kind of hanging out, so you have to decide, okay, um, this is the side that's gonna hang out right here. So I'm kind of being really heavy duty with this because I'm not sure what I wanna do. So if this were to go on here, and you were to put it right here, or say I even come in and I put it on this one, that's gonna hang out. and. It can't go out too much, I know, but it can go up that much. So this is what's going to show in the back. Do I mind that? No, kind of, no, I kind of am okay with that because I really zhuzhed it up. But you could do other things if you want. You could put some, like we could take this and actually go over the whole thing on the edge there and then come around. That's a tea bag, And that would give it a different look. Let's see what that would look like. Whoops, what have I done? I totally like tipped everything <laughs> upside down. Sorry guys, that's what happens sometimes. Totally put that like right on there. Maybe not even let, just glue this right on top of here. And if we were to open that up, come over, that's what it would look like on that side. So, you know, I'm, I'm pretty good with this. I'm gonna stick this right on here to come out. I don't want it to come out too far though because um, I think that paper is already sticking out quite a bit. So we're gonna glue right over to here. And this is pretty um, thick because it's got several layers. One, two, three, you know, four, the lace. So it's got a lot of layers going on already. So that would go right on there. Yep, that looks good. Let's see how our cover's doing. I want to just see how that's looking. And if I stick this in here, yeah, that's that's what's going to stick out. Whoops, can you see that? That's going to stick out like that, and I love that. I love it. Yep, not happy with this, this business here. Um, I don't know. I feel like it needs to be covered up a little bit. I don't know. All right, so for the rest of this video, I'm just simply gonna go through and um, go on each one, and I'm gonna start and just to put those in kind of the same place. I don't know if I want more than one. I might not want more than one. So, so if that's the first one, I'm gonna stagger them a little bit. Um, let's just go ahead. This one is a, quite a long one. That might be too much, too long. Let's go with a shorter one here. I mean, you don't even have to, you know, rip them all out because I could go over here and say, all right, I want this one. These were these were a lot of fun to do. I, I'm sure I have a video. If I can find it, see, so you can just take that one out and rip off the back a little bit if you want to. I want to use that one and I want to use this one. 
and a lot of that. I'm trying to make sure I stay in and I'm probably going over. So this one, we would want it to be down more here, like this probably. Oops, let me see, I wanna get that off there. Not sure which way this goes. And I don't think, it probably goes that way. All right, and we're gonna put it like right here. Put that there. So I'm trying to stagger them. Whoops. That's kind of real. Let's see. I'm trying to just stagger them. So you see, then you have this little staggered look, which I really like. Oops. You know, see what I didn't do? I didn't, um, oh, okay, I'm getting really crazy here. I need to, um, get this off here. Yeah, I should have done that before I flipped it, but that's okay. There you go. Okay, then this goes in here. Make sure we're all set. Yep. And this one goes on top. There you go. And then the next one, I'll come down here. So we'll do this one. And this one is going to come down here, maybe. Yeah, I'm going to come all the way down like this because I don't want, because there are six of them. So the next one then would go up higher. So this is the side that will be sticking out like that. So we'll just do this right here. going right there. Close that one. Let's see what these look like. Yep. And then the next one I'll start. Let's see. Let's put that one in here. That next one will go here and then maybe, I don't know, I'll try to go like in between or something. I'm not sure. Okay. These three. So let's tear out a couple more. What do we like? I, I like this one. We'll just tear this one right here. And then I like this one. I'm just gonna tear it like this so that it stays, that bottom part stays attached. And I need another one. What's that? Oh, interesting, back up torn up. These, these have a little, you know, just a lot of different stuff. Washi tape and, <clears throat> um, I have one with this one. Some of them, yeah, they don't all have exactly the same. They all started out the same with the same background and a little bit of book page. This needs to be, have a little glue. Somebody else needed glue. Did someone else need glue? Not you, I guess. All right, let's just tear this one down again. Now, these were fun. These were fun. Just sit down on an afternoon when you need a, a little something to do and you don't know what you want to do or you just are, you know, you could do these sitting in front of your TV watching the show. Okay, I'm just going to do all these at once. Okay. I'll tear this one down. These are just nice to have on hand because you can just pull them out and use them. 
and you can, you know, make whatever, make them sort of fit whatever. This one fits here because mostly these were pinks because, you know, I do a lot of pink because I just like it. All right, so we're going to do this one kind of up here at the top. Actually, up higher at the top than that. Whoops. Oh, I did that wrong. It's going to, have to go this way. I'm going to have to. Root. I'm going to have to uh, fix this. Yep, I'm probably getting glue all over my thing. Let's try that again. Here. Okay. That's glue. Get some of that one. See what that one looks like. I always like to check it. So that one's coming out a little further, and that might be too far. Let's see what that looks like in the cover. Let's see. Yeah, well, it's okay, though, actually, I think. It's coming out, but I think it's okay. This is going to be a really cute little journal. I don't know if I'm going to be able to part with this one. Of course, that's my problem. I don't want to part with any of my journals, you know? All right, these guys are good. This one's going to go down like here, maybe. Like here. Yep. Oh, these are so cute. Oops, is, did I grab the wrong one? Nope. Ones are done. Okay, this last one. Make sure I inked on the right side of it. Yep. Okay, let's just do, do a little inking further in because I'm not sure how that's going to stick out. Okay, there we go. And then this one goes to the bottom. Ah, oh, look at those. Ah, I love it. Oh, you're not sticking. Yeah, I'm going to have to fix you up. Look at those. And it's pretty full on this. You know, by the time I put pockets and things in, this is going to be like whew, big. But it's so cute. Okay. So we got our little edges on. So we did pretty good. I'm going to work a little more on this because it needs some more glue, especially down here on the ribbon part that's not sticking and it definitely needs something else up here I'm not sure what but something I mean like maybe even a cluster like that could go on there let's let's just take a second I know I know I keep going on and on don't I okay take some of that off whoops oh that's pretty that could go right on there like that yep let's do it just gonna do it that was it a little label a little cluster right up here is going to be perfect just like that just what it needed on the top yep and it still it still needs something there but that works there just lovely so there we go all right guys the second installment of the Dewey Journal all right. Thanks for watching so much. Have a wonderful day. Bye.